Greetings subscribers and other curious persons. I'm in the process of getting over a cold again, so if I suddenly explode or my voice goes really funny, that's probably it. Welcome to another vlog inspired by the Goodreads Tuesday Talks group. This week's topic is, do you read one genre or several? As I've mentioned before, I read almost anything. Serial packets, notices on walls, unattended matchboxes. So I will read anything. I have a few preferences that if I had a choice between two books I'd tend to go with. So if I had a choice between Mills and Boone romance and a vampire novel, or industrial plumbing of the 1940s and something of a Lovecraftian mythos nature, I'd choose vampires and cosmic evil over light romance or industrial plumbing. So, preferences, but <coughs> pardon me. If I only had one book, I'd read it because I prefer reading to not reading. As for when I read, again, there are certain favourite genres that I might read several in a row. And there are certain genres where I won't. So if I'm selecting books, I might read several fantasy books in a row, but I'm unlikely to read several romance novels in a row or several young adult novels in a row. Not because I find romance or young adult a less preferable genre, but because I find the concerns are often less engaging. I don't have an abiding interest in romance as a primary reason for reading books. I don't have a perfect life, but Romance-wise, I'm not suffering the pangs of unrequited angst or anything. So, for my escapism, I don't have a happy endings-shaped hole or a I-can't-decide-between-these-two-really-good-looking-boys-shaped hole. So, reading too much romance or young adult fiction can occasionally put me in a mind state where I want to stick two people in a room, lock the door and shout just get on with it through the letterbox because it's very it's a very meaningful and universal experience that the books are talking about but it's one that I found my answers to, so I don't feel the same engagement in the variations on how people might solve it as I do with variations upon being the chosen one to defeat unspeakable evil or discovering that vampires are real and finding out what real vampires actually can and can't do. So definitely I'll read almost anything but for certain genres I'm more likely to not binge read them because they're less immediately engaging to me in their core concerns. Which obviously privileges things that don't really have 
such a narrow core concern, such as fantasy and sci-fi, because it's a very broad category compared to romance, which always has to be about romance. But uh, there's my answer. Toodaloo!